Hello, and this is the Saturday Wrap for Saturday the 18th of June 2022, and it's 06.16 hours. I'm trying something a little bit different, which I will explain um, as we go along. Anyway, if you haven't seen this before, this is me babbling on about what happened to me during the week. It's mostly about beer. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Beer? Um, this is from my next door neighbours, my lovely next door neighbours. Um, it's brewed in the Ukraine, I think, or Ukraine. Unfortunately, it's AB InBev. Apparently, it's their favourite beer. Um, it's a bit thin, nice and malty, a little bit sweet. Um, nice, pleasing, malty finish, hint of bitterness. It's a stock lager, and it's nice when it's cold. And Thank you for that. I appreciate that. Anyway, so a um, couple of things. Word or the phrase of the week? Heat. Um, it got really warm. Yesterday it got, well, it was supposed to be in the 30s, and it was in quite a lot of places. However, not in Pontypridd, not in the lower Rumley Valley. It was warm. It was 25 degrees Celsius. It was really pleasant. Um, it was a little humid. It is still humid. Although there's rain forecast for today. And the highest temperature will be 17C. And that's at 10 o'clock in the morning. And then it'll fall away to 15. I'm looking forward to the rain because I'm fed up and going out with the watering can and watering things. Water meter. Uh, that's the issue. Anyway, um, the thing of the week, because that's another one, um, is a preemptive, and it's the rail stroke train strike. Um, Saturday, Thursday, and Tuesday of next week, um, and of course, in between them all, it'll be chaos, and there's reduced services, and I think around here, the only trains that are running are Radha to Merthyr and Radha to Aberdeer. There's a bus between Radha and Cardiff. Yeah, whatever. Um, it would be hard to notice the difference sometimes. Um, we had um, the Stereophonics and Tom Jones in the Principality Stadium last night and tonight, and there's chaos on the trains already. And the M4. Because we really don't think about these things. Uh, thank you, Mr. Eric Honecker. The app of the week. The app of the week is the one that I'm using at the moment. Um, it's a thing called Camo Studio. It could be completely Sherlocked by um, Mac OS Ventura um, with continuity camera. I am using my iPhone 13 Pro cameras and a bit of software, a Camo Studio and some lights. And I've got my notes on my iPad mini. And of course, I've got my. Um, well, this is it in the glass. Um, it's not free, although there is a free version, but that's watermarked and limited to 720p. This is a 1080p. The camera is much better as far as I can tell. Um, let me know what you think. Um, I just like all this sort of thing. And I think it shows the quality of the webcams that you get. I mean, I tend to use external webcams, but they're not as good as this. You know. Anyway, um, let's start with last Sunday. I think I had a hangover. I haven't had a hangover for years. I just had a little bit of a headache, and I was lethargic and fatigued, and it disappeared by lunchtime. And the only thing I can think of is not drinking enough fluids when I got home, um, because it was rather warm. Talking of that, Sunday morning, I am now on 4.5 TOG on the duvet front. Usually it's halfway through uh, May, but I think it's been quite cool. But now it isn't. Now it's, well, you know, it was 25 yesterday and things. So I'm on the uh, the lower TOG rating, and at the moment, with the window wide open, I don't need to sleep on top of it, but I think that's coming before long. Mind you, next week, the longest day of the year, and then the nights will start drawing in. 
we've only just re oh this year's disappearing uh this summer's disappearing um and i need more binos i like going away and testing software and such like he says anyway so uh there was a bit of planting out I planted out two cucumber plants. I planted some more cucumbers and some more peppers. Peppers really went well. The cucumbers, not so much. So I might have to do another one of those. Uh, my green fingers aren't that green this year. Apart from potatoes, they just grow, grow, grow. And um, Blue Danube from a couple of years ago. They're growing and they've got lovely flowers. And they make great chips, he said. Anyway. Monday. The office was closed, working from home. Apparently, our fire doors weren't fire doors, so we weren't fire safe. I'm not that keen on working from home, but sometimes it's not too bad. Um, you can get up a little bit later um, and uh, certainly save on the petrol. Which um, Sainsbury's in Pontypridd yesterday, 191.9, was it 191? No, 181.9 uh, a litre for unleaded. I think it was 191 for diesel. Luckily, I didn't follow the advice from uh, Gordon Brown to buy a diesel to save the world. <sighs> oh, um. Anyway, um, I, um, I'm in the process of swapping over Sims. Um, uh, both uh, my iPad Pro, which has an internal SIM slot, and my MiFi, they've been moving from 3 UK to Smarty UK, owned by the same company. Uh, Smarty is completely online. The first one, it went well. It went really went well. It was cheaper, and uh, it came, and I activated it, and it was fine. The second one for the MiFi, put it into a group, got 10% off. It was already cheaper and far, far, far more data than I was getting with 3. Um, but long story short, took two and a half days. Um, online chat to the support who are very nice, but I don't think they're in this country. And um, I was misunderstood, even though they couldn't hear me and I was typing. Still, it's up and working now. And when my contract for my iPhone runs out, I'm definitely moving to them. Really, really, really. No mid-year price increases, far more data. Same coverage as three. European roaming is thrown in as well. Not that I plan on going there. It's hard to get to Caffili without being skinned, to be perfectly honest. But, um, yeah, there were issues. They did sort it out. I did do need to do the odd tweet, but um, the support staff are friendly and helpful, which is good. Um, the tumble. They're painting it purple on the inside. A couple of times this week, they had areas blocked off and they were painting it. Although the carpet around the bar area, although the bar area itself is vinyl, um, where they go back and forth to the back area of the bar, I think that's going to need replacing. And I've noticed the last couple of weeks, while it is busy... It's not that busy. Uh, like Fridays, went over there with Ty. Um, it was fullish, but usually on a Friday, completely packed out. Yeah, I think times are hard. Mind you, their aircon, especially yesterday, welcome relief. No aircon in the office, obviously, just windows open. And a USB fan, not plugged into any kit as per the rules. I think it was Wednesday, came home, do not bend thing was there, 40 years working for the department certificate. Doesn't time fly? 40 years? I might see if I can get a frame and put it somewhere, although I've got the PDF version of it, which I prefer, because, you know, paperless office and all that sort of stuff. Lead by example. <laughs> Ah, uh, right. Um, uh, yeah, also Wednesday, planting tomatoes. Friday, planting tomatoes. So I've got four, four plants out now. They're lisanos, they're bush type, so they don't need staking. They're also blight resistant, which you need around here. You get hammered down with rain, and then it gets really hot and steamy, and then you get blight done. And, uh, and they're very Moorish. Been out the mo this morning with the watering can, watering them off. 
also on Wednesday, an email from Plusnet. They're my ISP. I'm paying about £31 at the moment um, for 60 up and 15 no, 60 down and 15 up and line rental and all that sort of thing. Um, next month, my contract comes to an end and it would have got up to £48, which I uh, would have fallen off my chair, but I was in the tumble and I was drinking beer at the time. Uh, I read on and they could do me the same um, with extra free calls on the landline, which I never make. 18-month um, contract, twenty four ninety nine. Had a little look around. That's not a bad deal. That's not a bad deal as well. And their service has been very reliable. Their support is so-so. Um, but, you know, cheaper. And with the Sims, cheaper. And times are hard. So, yeah, I re-upped like the wind. Okay. Um, I was reading a thing about detail, which is sort of the same as Cabo Studio. Uh, which I did try out and then uh, uninstalled because I just didn't have enough grunt. But they say they are going all out for the M series, the M1s, the M2s. And I think now is the right time, definitely, to upgrade. I've talked about this before. Um, my i5, which I'm using at the moment, and it seems to be working well, it just doesn't have enough grunt. And... Developers are optimizing for non-Intel machines. The um, MacBook Pro 13-inch M2 went on sale yesterday. Um, and if you want a non-standard one, i.e. 512 and 16 gigs, which I want for my MacBook Air, they're already out into August. So I think I'm going to have delivery issues. I hope I don't, but I have a feeling that I do. Anyway, as I said earlier on, all my sims are now live. Uh, I can see them in my dashboard. I just haven't swapped it into my MIFA yet, which I need to do later on. Um, as I said yesterday, it was hot. It's now humid. Um, it's now going to rain. I'm repeating myself. Ooh, um, re-upped a week last Friday for Apple TV Plus, who have now got Major League Football in America, although not all the games. If you want all of them, it's an extra thing. Um, who was it? Wayne Rooney. He used to manage DC United. I wouldn't mind seeing DC United, because I know someone from just outside DC. Yeah, <laughs> if for no other reason. Um, yeah, so um, for All Mankind Series 3, Episode 2 last night, Game Changer it was called. It was a Game Changer. Things are really looking up with it. It is magnificent. It is tech. It is discrimination. It is personal. It is oldies and youngies. It is... Well worth seeing. And I believe you can get the first series for free. Um, just download the app from practically anywhere. And it, the app works on practically everything, including Fire Sticks. First series, very good. Alternative view of history. Anyway, so I'm going to get this uploaded. And I'm off to Malcolm Uphill. And then um, Brew Monster. And then I'll get a lot wet. Anyway, so I'm going to look over there and um, turn it off, Ooh, 13 minutes.